Hi there, thanks for watching. Uh, this is the simplest Christmas square recipe I've ever uh, made. It has four ingredients. Um, it's super fast and it tastes amazing. Um, I don't actually know where the recipe came from. I just heard it word of mouth, so I can't uh, credit anybody, but it is four ingredients. It's kind of expensive actually, because you have to buy these ingredients. But if you need something quick that tastes amazing at a party or whatever, people will love this. So let's get down to it. So first thing you want to do is take out the Ritz crackers and crush them up without even taking them out of the bag. You want to crush them into a very fine powder. Not crazy fine, but I'll show you. Okay, so this is kind of what you want them to look like. Like, no big pieces, um, but a few tiny pieces is okay. So just put it in a mixing bowl. So next, we just want to add the score bits. Um, the toffee bits, I guess they're called. Where I am, they're called score. And you want to add the sweetened condensed milk and mix that together. So now we have the sweetened condensed milk, the score bits, and the Ritz crackers. And we're just going to mix it with a spoon until it's well incorporated. I'll show you when it's done. Okay, that's what it should look like when it's done. It's kind of a sticky, uh, but all the all of it is wet and well incorporated. Now we're just going to put it into a Pyrex, smooth it over, and throw it in the oven for about 20 minutes at 350. So you want to kind of, I'll see if I can show you. It's kind of, it goes in kind of lumpy. You just kind of want to flatten it. You don't want to like compress it hard, but you want to get it flat. Okay, we're just gonna pop it in the uh, toaster oven here for 350 for 20 minutes. And it should kind of bubble a little bit and we'll come back and check on it. Okay, so the 20 minutes is up. And let's just take these out. So what you're looking for is kind of um, a little bit of browning around the edge, just the tips of the little browning. Obviously there's nothing actually to cook in here, so it's not like you need to worry too much, but you want the right texture. So now that that's done 20 minutes, now what we do is we lay our score bars on top, or arrow bars actually, sorry. And why you do this is then you don't have to melt the chocolate. So you just leave that be, and about five minutes you come back and you smooth the chocolate over the whole surface so it's nice and smooth. And then you're done. So I'll show you that. Okay, so now that chocolate's melted, you just come in here and just smooth it out. So you get it to be a nice even coat. So I'll do this uh, off camera. It's kind of tricky with one hand. Or, but uh, then I tend to throw it in the fridge so that I can have a bite relatively soon. These are amazing. I've never had somebody say they don't like them. And uh, I think you'll like them if you try them. Thanks for watching.